All right, hey, welcome back. This is Daryl Evans, co-founder of Yoko Local. And in this series, we're talking about the, the various things that are challenging from a marketing standpoint online today and how things have changed. The buyer's in control of how they gather information online. And in this video, I wanna talk specifically about uh, the, the word and the name is a little bit semantic depending on where you hear it, but I wanna talk about buyer personas. Sometimes you may hear it called target marketing or target consumer. You might even hear it called an avatar. What we're really talking about and really where the crux of a marketing strategy has to start, it has to start with clearly identifying who your buyer is. And I hear it so many times when I'm interviewing business owners when we're starting to plan marketing strategy and game plan and get into the tactics, uh, I'll ask them who their ideal customer is and they'll give me an answer like, well, anyone who and you know, let's say I'm talking to an air conditioning company, anyone who owns a home, if I'm talking to a realtor, anyone who's renting a home, if they're selling something to purchase, um, if I'm talking to a, a lawyer or an attorney who does estate planning, I hear you know, anyone who is high net worth. Uh, I hear this thing over and over and over again. And what I wanna help you understand and, and really get in your mind is that everyone is not your customer. Everyone is not your customer. Let me give you an example. I was in the mortgage industry, as I said in an earlier video, and what I knew in, in, in my business back then, I understood that first-time buyers, they thought a little bit differently than investors who thought a little bit differently than people who had owned their first home and they were moving up to maybe, maybe their career was taking off and they were moving up to their, we call them move up homes or their uh, luxury home if they were, maybe they took off in their career and they're now making $500,000 a year and they're gonna buy the, you know, their McMansion if you will. And they were different than someone relocating from one state to another and they were different than someone who was perhaps in the military who was transferring to our marketplace. Just in that example, I just broke down five or six buyer personas. Each of them have the same objective to buy a home, but they don't journey through the process the same way. They need the same things, which means they had at some point to get pre-qualified, they had to get a loan application done, they had to go through the mortgage process, but their process of discovering and becoming aware and considering their purchase options took different shapes. But if I had one set process to discuss my services with that particular, you know, if I had one process to go over six different buyer personas, then I would have struggled to grow my business. So the concept in this video is that I want you to think about the various types of customers that have come through your business or that come through your sales processes. Maybe it's product related, maybe it's service related, Maybe even inside of a service, there are levels of those types of services where one customer may want to buy one service where another customer buys another one. When we look at online marketing, each of those buyer personas will go through the buying stages at different frequencies, they'll ask different questions, and that's how your marketing has to be built together. But it all starts with strategic thinking around your customer. So buyer persona, avatar, target customer, target niche, a lot of those words play together, but that's really where all of your success in marketing will start. And you can start seeing more effectiveness, more ROI, more return on investment, in case you're not familiar with that phrase, and better results in growing your business. So we're gonna move into the next step of the process or the next step that we like to share with our clients. And uh, hopefully that was helpful for you. And we'll see you in the next video.